Hey guys, it's Erica. We're gonna be checking out Vichas Y O Universe dance practice choreography video, whatever. Um, I'm really excited to get really this choreography. This did drop like a few days ago. I just it wasn't on my radar because I wasn't. When I go to like my list of like what I'm reacting to, I go through like my subscriptions. Um, and I wasn't subscribed to their YouTube channel because they're a new group, and sometimes that happens. Um, but I'm really excited to get a look at the full choreography, how they do it with six of them because saw it because I watched A2K so I saw everything within the show and I know all their journeys with dance and everything um so I also want to just get like a little bit of like an in-depth look at it because when you're watching the show and the camera angles and everything it's kind of it's sometimes it's a little hard to like more like analyze what they're doing and then you go into like a live performance um which isn't like a controlled environment um so seeing like what they did with their like live performances when they were doing their like units or, um, or their team performances for this one. Um, I can only judge like so much so really seeing what they are doing with this one I feel like I'm gonna get a good sense of this like where they are with their skill levels like right now because they didn't have like the most time to train as a as idols so um, it's, it's very interesting to see what JYP is doing with that because most idols have more training, but um, most, not all, it depends. It always depends on the idol about how many years they had training. Um, some a decade, some a decade. Um, but yeah, but I'm really excited to get a better look at the choreography, facing it and its whole everything. I mean, they're popping up all over my TikTok and everything, but dance practice is always going to be a little different. So yes, you know, with it, let go. I mean, it's a great opening formation. Okay. Texture is good. Nice. Energy is there. Hello. Nice. Okay, KG. Yeah, this seems even a lot better than what we saw on the TV show. Or the survival show. It's on TV, it's on YouTube. I mean, it's gonna be good choreography. Gabby choreographed it. Nice. Nice. Okay, floor work. Yeah, they're very clean. Okay. Nice. They're very clean, they're very in sync. And they did have a lot of time with this choreography, so... Ooh. End it. Cause they, I mean, they had a month for their, uh, to learn it for their final performances and then whatever time from there to this to adjust and sort of practice it. So they do have a lot of time with it, but, um, so they should be this good with it, you know, but I think it's great. The formation changes and everything are really cool to see. I think it's very, it's very complimentary for the girls and I kind of like how different their choreography feels because I don't, it's, well, this is also pre debut stuff. So we don't necessarily know what we're getting out of like their actual debut. Um, 
but for like pre-debut stuff I feel like it's showing enough skills that I need to see from like that I would look for any other girl group any other artists just in general what I would like kind of be looking for so they really showcase that they're very clean and of course a dance practice like this without doing any vocals or any performance is going to highlight just like the choreography and their dancing skills so um it's not always that what you see in a dance practice doesn't always occur what's exactly you're gonna get on a stage um, but I still think they really killed it. Um, yeah, and they have really, yeah, I mean, they hit everything. All the details are there. I can't really, I mean, yeah, the song is so catchy. Girl, this song has been stuck in my head for like a long time. Um, it's, it has that infectious vibe to it. But yeah, I think the choreography is really great. I mean, their dance skills are all there. Um, even though they are kind of still at very different levels individually, I feel like together it's really nice what we're getting here. And the thing is like when you're dancing with people you can have a lot of chemistry like personally with somebody um but then that's very different than having chemistry with people when you're dancing um just because like sometimes it's not so like like individually personalities can like vibe but like when you're dancing and you have to make something like this a performance that is very supposed to be very kind of like uniform um it's sometimes it's a little bit harder to adjust because then you have to adjust your skills for what makes sense for the group and not yourself specifically but i think they took their skills and really highlighted them i would say some of the formation they, it is even groups are a little tricky with formations just because like how it's you don't always get like a pretty v pretty nice clean v one two three four five six somebody behind them you know for like if it was like a v formation um so like it does get a little bit tricky to choreograph formations with even numbers especially six i mean we've seen it with eight groups eight members that have worked really well but um so it'll be interesting to see just like what they do for it and i feel like some of the formations because i guess it was originally choreographed for four and then adjustments had to be made you can kind of very much see that but i think the adjustments that they made for the formations make a lot of sense i will say though the I don't know if it was like the camera angle necessarily, but, and their heights were all different, but if there was a moment where one of them was dancing like directly behind in the formation of somebody else, it wasn't like, sometimes I feel like in a lot of, well, it's not really super common th these days for choreography to just kind of throw a member behind um, whoever is center. But like a lot of times they like disappear and they're so clean and they're so in sync. But I don't know if it's cause it was like their different heights or like the camera angle, they didn't necessarily always disappear behind somebody like there'd be like an arm or a head that i'd see and i feel like a lot of times i'm not used to like seeing that but it kind of i don't know like it was that's kind of like the only thing that i have is that like i don't know if it's like meant to be if you're meant to see somebody sometimes um and some of it did feel like uneven for part of it but then again with like six members and you're trying to showcase all of them it's probably going to feel uneven in some capacity it's just i feel like because we're kind of used to a lot of even numbered groups these days um, and like uneven formation changes, it's not necessarily been like something I've thought about um, for a while. I thought of it here, um, but yeah, no, I think the dancing skills are great. It looks better seeing this uh, choreography video here today than they were when we kind of first saw them do this performance. And of course, when you just get better and you practice more over time, it's just gonna become like muscle memory and everything um but yeah so i think this was really really great i can't wait for their actual debut to see what we're getting from them and everything we're getting from them in the future um i'm all aboard for the ride go to pretty thoughts guys i'll let you that about vichas yo universe dance practice if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go to hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter instagram tiktok threads or in the description down below or at the end screen if you like gaming content i have a gaming channel it's called i could just games currently playing resident evil 2 for a spooky season so i hope you could join me over there for that thank you guys so, so much for watching love you and i'll talk to you guys later bye I'm a